Right, what's up guys, my name's Eli, and today I'm gonna clone myself using the 4th Axis shot clock. We're gonna take a series of photos, <laughs> and then we're gonna drop those pictures into a photogrammetry stitching software. That program will give us a mesh file, and we'll be able to drop that on the shot bot and create a 3D version of myself, or a clone. Let's get it. Right here. All right, so the first try at this, the photogrammetry stitching capture worked really well, but we were missing some image detail for the top of my head. So my buddy Jasper redid it, and we're gonna drop it in the editor and see how it turns out. So let's go. mesh file over to the shot bot. It's in a program called Aspire. So the Aspire software is going to translate the mesh file into a tool path for the shot bot. And that's what gives us our 3D model. So this particular CNC can use several different types of bits on a lot of different types of materials from hard foam, plastic, wood, aluminum, and it'll spin those bits up to 18,000 RPM. I think it looks pretty good. The first iteration had uh, not as much detail and we made a little bit bigger uh, a version of it. I think it turned out pretty good. The shot bot was at a pretty conservative speed. I think it goes all the way up to 30. We only had it at eight or 10. I had to change out a couple bits for the, uh, the roughing and then the fine work. But overall it went pretty well. Only took a couple hours. That's kind of a Roman Empire, I don't know. 